Central Healing Service. Central Healing Service. There's no better place to be. Great Evangelism World Crusade invites you to a monthly healing service. Come with the sick, the oppressed and broken hearted. Come as you are. Our Lord Jesus Christ is waiting to give you a new life. The man of God of our time, Apostle G.D. Numberi, shall be there to minister God's word, real and undiluted, with signs and great wonders. Date is Sunday, 24th August 2014. Time, 9am prompt. Venue, Great Evangelism World Headquarters along Port Harcourt International Airport Road, Rupoko, Port Harcourt. Jesus is calling you today. Come and be blessed. This is Great Evangelism World Crusade. Pentecostal evangelism in rivers and bias of faith, and even in the north, Apostle Numbera, as anointed as ever, is here to point out and correct errors in the body of Christ, and also to prepare the church for the rapture through his in-depth and balanced teachings of the Word of God. The program cut off will be aired every week on this channel at the same time. Question: Is it saving lives or? making money in great evangelism we do not teach people how to make money we teach people how to make heaven may the words of my mouth and the meditations of my heart be acceptable in thy sight O Lord my God and my Redeemer Amen. Amen. Beloved, this is Great Evangelism World Crusade. So my people, this church, now Greater Evangelism World Crusade. That's where you are now and that's what you have tuned into. Now the place when you day and now the place when you they see the people when you they see now. I always ask a question. They get question when are they ask every time. This gospel we preach, is it for making money or is it for making heaven? And they ask the question, say, this Bible when we they preach. What you make with the preacher? Now to take and get money or to take and enter heaven? In great evangelism, we do not teach people how to make money. I beg make you think that question. But inside greater evangelism, we know they teach people how they go to get money. We teach people how to make heaven. The thing when we they teach people now how then go enter heaven? For it profited no man anything if he should gain the whole world and lose his soul. Because he no go there better for any man. If he get the whole world, if the whole world be owned, he can enter inside hellfire. That man never gain anything. What shall it profit a man? What profit? Waiting that man go get, or waiting any man go gain. In January of this year, for January this year, in that healing service, for that healing service, I preached on the topic, Jesus Christ, the conqueror of Satan. I preached for that healing service, and the head of my preaching, he said, Jesus Christ, the person when they win Satan. 
And I took my text from Genesis chapter 3 and verse 15. And we read Genesis chapter 3, number 15. And I will put enmity between thee and the woman, and between thy seed and her seed. He shall bruise thy head, and thou shalt bruise his heel. Genesis chapter 3, verse 15. Genesis chapter 3, number 15. And God can't tell the test set and here say, I go bring enmity, that one be said, I go bring quarrel between the Pekin when you go born and the Pekin when the woman go born. Your own Pekin go wound them for leg. But the Pekin when the woman go born, go scatter your head. The seed of the woman. The Pekin the when the woman go born. And the seed of Satan. And the Pekin when Satan go born. So in this service, I have given it the title, The Doctrine of the Two Seeds. The Doctrine of the Two Seeds. The seed of the woman and the seed of serpent. For this service, I they give them another head. And the head, na, the lesson went there for these two picking them. The picking of Satan and the picking of the woman. The doctrine of the two seeds. The lesson, the teaching, went there inside these two picking them. God said, I will put enmity between the two seeds. God talks, say, he go bring quarrel for these two picking them. And it is meant to be a perpetual enmity. And this quarrel, now quarrel will not go end. And I want you to know there is in this world the seed of the woman and the seed of the devil. And I want to make you sabi. Say inside this world, when we day inside, Satan gets his own picking them. The woman gets his own picking too. The seed of the woman on God's side. The picking when the woman go born, go there with God. Against the seed of the serpent on the other side. And they go to quarrel. The picking when Satan go born when they the other side. So we have in the world the church of God. So inside this world, we get the church of God, the church when the God church. And the synagogue of Satan. And the church when the Satan church. It is a present reality. This thing when they talk to now, now the thing when they happen even now. Because God said so in the beginning of the history of man that there will be the seed, the godly seed, and there will be the seed of Satan, of the serpent. Because God talk him from the time when he make human being, say, we go get the seed of the woman, the picking of the woman, when go be God own people, and the begin when Satan go born, when go be Satan own people. We have the believers and we have the unbelievers. We get people when be believers and we get people when be unbelievers. Those who are born after the flesh are the seed of the serpent. Do you people when they say they are alive, then they leave them as their body, they tell them. Anything when hungry, them for their body, nothing then they do. 